One incredible thing about being here in Water Valley is that, you know, we're only an hour away from my restaurant. I mean, how many varieties of mushrooms do you think we curated or cultivated? I feel like we found 30 plus yeah. uh, of varieties of mushrooms and it's so incredible just to see that diversity here in the... In the and like a small area of like maybe a couple kilometers and the smells, like everyone has a different smell and a different texture and a and different it, look. And a different way that we're going to cook each one and, yeah. and treat it. It's so incredible. <laughs> yeah. I'm super excited for the guests to actually like experience literally the terroir, like you're literally going to taste Water Valley in the food, because that's exactly where we found it. I mean, I feel like the idea is that they're gonna be kind of walking with us while they're sitting yes. at, the, at the table. And it's not just the mushrooms. It was so cool when I was able to give you the lung board, and oh. you just, what did you taste? And you tasted this leaf, but it's from the forest. What was like the big flavor? I had this epiphany. It was, it tasted exactly like oyster. Like, like an I, oyster? Like, like, like this, the minerality and the, you yeah, know, like, like almost the- Yeah, in a way. A little bit of sweetness too. Yeah. Oh. Oyster hits me, and I just love that you can get that flavor of the sea super inland in a forest here in Water Valley. The diversity, even this late in the season, is, is unparalleled. And it's literally like an hour out. It's that's, crazy. It's staggering, yeah. staggering. As a chef, that's pretty, it's pretty in interesting to be like, I foraged that, I took that. Yes, 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 that connection right there is, is so special. And it's, it's something that, that even it gives you more inspiration to pay you know, homage to that, that, that experience. That, yeah, and that experience, absolutely.